What's up guys, it's Awana Turtle and today we are continuing our streak of opening up some new products. So we got another big tin. Today we're going with the Venusaur Celebi tin. That's the last one that we have yet to open. And so yesterday we did the little tin or the this little guy right here. And to, so today we're going with the round tin, which is I believe this is a great ball. Sorry if I'm incorrect. Um, so my initial thoughts on this thing is uh, I'm not sure how much product can fit in here. Sounds like there might be a coin or something. Uh, however, I'm a little concerned about the cards inside. And I think it's pretty cool, but uh, whenever I hold on to this ball, I have the urge to kind of just like throw it, which probably isn't a good idea. I uh, feel like it might, it might break or it might break something. And so just a quick update on the little tin is the card inside this guy so it does not fit into a regular sleeve uh, penny sleeve or top loader however it does fit quite nicely into these card saver ones so just in uh, if, if you are worried about you know keeping it in good condition uh, that's probably the way to go to sleeve it and lastly for the little tin um, so just a quick update as far as oh what can I put in this uh, so here are the cards from yesterday's video and it does work nicely as a way to store sleeved cards and the reason I say sleeved cards is that um, the card will remain protective I think over time the sleeves will just kind of like have bends in the corner uh, by that point you know the whole the whole point of the sleeve is just to protect the card so it serves its purpose there um, so ultimately this thing is actually uh, can be quite useful. You can kind of store some of your, uh, your your nice cards in there. Just make sure you put them in a sleeve. So this thing is not just for mints. Looking at you collecting together. All right, let's jump into the opening, guys. All right, guys, let's jump into this. To be honest, I have no idea what's in this. Uh, so, but it did. I did see that there are three booster packs in here as well as a coin. Uh, surprised that three booster packs can fit in here. So let's see. Uh, one thing I think would be awesome is like, I mean, obviously there's more, it's more work and more money, but if this could be like you push this button and then it kind of just like springs open, I think that'd be awesome. But it kind of just pops open like that. Ooh, look at these packs. I am a little concerned. That looks like a Ninetales? But, uh, hmm don't feel like this is a good way to store any or cards at least sleeved or unsleeved doesn't seem like a good idea so let's see we got mm, this is just okay we have some steam siege which yeah. and then sun and moon base and guardians rising when it comes to xy sets what are we looking for no idea let's see is it like this oh god figured out one day guys all right let's see hmm if I look at these corners I feel like they're all nicked a little bit all right let's see we got a shell done shield on a a bib palm <laughs> tangro a fungus bergmite joltik a mantine clink a brev Bravari, Braviari, and then ooh, Volcanian EX. Um, but one nice thing about XY is that you know I'm not familiar with all the cards, so it is like ooh, I've never actually seen this card before. So I'm uh, I, maybe I'm being too harsh on like the Steam Siege, the um, and whenever there's like Roaring Skies and stuff like that. So that was that was a good hit. Won't lie. All right, let's move on to Sun and Moon Base. When it comes to what we're looking for here, I think is this the one with the Secret Rare Ultra Ball? Alright, let's see. We got a fighting energy. Her deer. I think I, I do like that card. Uh Alolan Persian. I feel like this is like the ugliest Alolan <laughs> Pokemon. A Dark Tricks, Grubbin, Firo, Snubble, Sandile, Picky Peck. Ooh, great ball. Oh, okay, so confirmed this thing is a great ball <laughs> and then our rare is just a beware all right last one is guardians rising all 
and this one the corners the corners do seem okay all right so there wasn't too much there wasn't like a concerning amount of damage although when i pulled those packs out ooh, look at this tentacruel that looks awesome uh however it wasn't crazy about how they're just kind of stuffed in there machoke clefairy rockruff pretty cute barboach this is like one of the most boring looking pokemon in my opinion Ooh, that geodude looks pretty cool that floating rock fletchling a lampant for the reverse and then oh metagross gx very nice man we have been we've been doing good in the last uh the last bunch of openings so yeah well I, one thing i want to hit while i fumble around trying to open this tin while talking is uh one you know one thing that i'm really happy about with this channel is uh you know the videos become like a forum to just kind of talk about you know the state of um the tcg and uh so shout out to uh individuals like mama kangaskhan uh rochester the gnome it's i just love you know give, exchanging our thoughts about the new products and you know what what we think are what we're happy about what we're not happy to see and stuff like that so yeah shout outs to you guys um and uh yeah if you haven't checked those guys out before uh i'll put, post like a link in the description below t for their channels as well um and it's i don't know I, I feel like that's awesome where um this can kind of become a forum for just random topics of discussion like that so yeah thanks for thanks for kind of helping that happen uh i do have to say like this this uh, GX counter thing uh, is really nice and then we have our four packs and as per usual forbidden light and evolutions and then two team up Venusaur so uh, Mama Kang's kind didn't make the clarification that uh, so these uh, this alternate full arts these ones weren't in the team up set which is why the they are in the promo uh, so that is good to know I wasn't aware of that however I, I still think that it kind of devalues the cards in general or at least uh actually when it comes to if people play competitively maybe it's better to have a cheaper way to get some of the cards i'm especially like the the pikachu zekrom so i, I still have mixed feelings about it but i can see there, it's good to know the facts about it so let's jump into all right this one the corners are Ooh, this one has the top has a little bit of damage and that's like the rare Oh, <laughs> we got a Clefairy, guys. Uh, I've been going a little too fast. I did the, the pack trick wrong. So, but just to quickly go through those cards then. And a Super Potion Reverse. I feel like we've been doing pretty good with Forbidden Light. Last time we got that Greninja Full Art. Ugh, gosh, I feel, I, it, I feel like it's random. Which one? I can't figure it out which... Which uh, uh, for which one is the whether to show it like that or just put the thing around? All right, we got an unidentified fossil. I think we're gonna get something, guys. Mesprit, Floet, Scatterbug, Gumi, Dupider. That's an interesting one. The baby. <laughs> that one's even weirder. Esper, Crusher, Wake, and ooh, guys, we got something. Let's see what it is. Oh, another full art. Dude, we're, we're, we, we've got Forbidden Light down. <laughs> so we do have a Palkia GX. Very nice. So at some point, if I, if, you have, if I ever hit like a cold streak and you hear me complain, just remind me of this time when, when things were going super well for an extended period of time. All right, let's see. We got Electro Charger. Um, this card, uh, the Electro Powers are actually pretty cool. The Electro Charger, I'm not sure. If it's good enough. All right, so then we got a Ponyard, a Star You, ooh, Judge's Whistle. We did pull a secret rare version of this in one of our booster boxes. And then our last card is gonna be a Kabutops. All right, last pack, guys. Although, so far, it's already been a great opening. We got a Water Memory, Golduck, Pancham, Voltorb, Klefki, Charmander, Mankey, <laughs> a little in you, dude. Claymation version. And for our last card in the opening, we have a Tyranitar Hollow. 
Uh, so I guess this, it is seven packs. I'm surprised they fit three booster packs in that little Pokeball. Uh, so let's just go through them. For our regular GX, we did get a Metagross. Volcanion EX from Steam Siege. Man, this card, this card looks good, I won't, won't lie. Uh, Palkia GX full art from Forbidden Light Pack, and then the alternate art Celebi Venusaur. Um, this art's pretty good, although I definitely think the Pikachu Zekrom one is better. So there you guys have it. Overall, the Pokeball products. Um, that that's another one which it's pretty cool, but I have no idea what to do with that tin. I'll probably just like display it behind me, uh, and after that or at, you know beyond one I'm not sure do what to do with other ones uh, so as far as versatility I feel like the big tin I'm not sure how what the best way to store cards in it is but I'm looking to find one again if you have an idea of or uh, if if that's good for uh, storing cards let me know um, the mini tin I'm not sure what else to call it. Canto and Friends Mini Tin. Um, I do think that that one's a little bit better, a little bit easier. Um, just the fact that it has the uh, rounded corners just might just mean it just damaged your sleeves. But again, I think that's okay. Um, and then well, we just talked about the Pokeball one. Um, so there you guys have it, guys. Pretty good opening. Um, and stay tuned for tomorrow's video. We're going to announce another giveaway. So stay tuned for that. And as well, we're going to announce one on Instagram. So definitely follow me there if you're not already. On that, guys, thanks for watching. Uh, I'm Awana Turtle, and I'll catch you guys next time. Peace. But wait, guys, there's more. We forgot to open our pack of uh, Burning Shadows. So here we go. The hunt for the Rainbow Charizard continues. Assuming I can remember to do this each video, which I uh, keep forgetting. I kind of like, uh, kind of tore down the, the set. Oh, God darn it. All right, let's see what we got. Psychic Energy, Rabambi, Curlia, Olivia, Stuffle, Morlul, Zanigas, Venipede, Forcey, Curlia again for the reverse variety, and then a Tangrowth regular rare. So, at that point, guys, it's a Wanna Turtle, and I'll catch you guys tomorrow. Peace.